Ladies and gentlemen, placings are complete in our fall yearling class. First place, bread and known, entry 3145, Seco Fever Pitch, exhibited by Tyler Cessna of Clearville, Pennsylvania. In third place, entry 3141, Phoenix GR Gloria, exhibited by Crystal, Jordan, Connor, Jake, Josh, and Lauren Seamers of Newton, Wisconsin. In second place, entry 3154, MD Dunlofen Lothority Ellie, exhibited by Earhart and Jaeger, Covell, Eaton and Morrill of Baldwin, Maryland. And your winning entry is entry 3142, Fanicole Reginald Marty, exhibited by Covell, Eaton, Morrell, Conroy Posada, and Garcia of Preble, New York. Congratulations. <laughs> Judge your comments. What other tremendous class of heifers here, and what a beautiful heifer we have to come right to the top of the class. And uh, she came there fast, and she'll stay there easy. She's just a beautiful, stylish, balanced heifer. She's an October heifer, and a heifer you certainly got to admire the size and scale, yet she's got that beautiful quality the whole way through. She's got the femininity through her head and neck, the beautiful open sweep to her rib, the quality of her bone structure. And she's a heifer that just gets out here, handles herself so nice, carries herself a little harder out through her loin region than this silky black heifer we have following in second. Heifer in second and another extremely quality heifer. You love the balance of the heifer from end to end. Another heifer that's wide chested. She's got that big drop to her fore rib. She's knit together quite nicely up through her front end. You like the high chine. Maybe just a heifer that gives you a little more stylish appearance through the head and neck when she gets out on the move. Then a real similar heifer following in third. Heifer in third, another heifer that's extremely well balanced. She's got a little more lift up through her front end. Just a little more natural dairiness look to her today for me. Then a real long framed white heifer coming out in fourth. Heifer in fourth, you love the length she displays from end to end. A heifer that's got that tremendous midsection. And for us today, she's just a little stretchier. A little flashier the whole way through than an extremely well-balanced heifer in fifth. Heifer in fifth just gives you a little more natural open appearance, a little more dairy, and uh, just a little freer moving on her hind legs when she gets out on the move than a real nice open-framed heifer coming in sixth.